Peace and prosperity, man, to all who's listening and watching. It's your girl, Shamala Ray, and I'm back with another video. And guys, today is a lovely day. It feels so great outside. I have not been outside besides the fact that I did go to work today. And that was like the only time. And when I went to work, it was like very early in the morning. It was too early to like enjoy. And it was really hot at that time. Now it's later on in the day and it's very cool and very, you know, good feeling. I enjoy being outside when it's at nighttime or at this time when it's like cool or the stars are out. But so I've been working on improving that sketchbook because I know I told you guys to wait at least two weeks to start purchasing it. Um, which will be ready by then. But I'm saying I've been working hard to figure out how to improve the mistakes that I've made with the sketchbook so that it can have better quality quality right my biggest thing is was marketing and i know i talked to you guys about my issues with marketing i did reach out to somebody who i thought or think because it's still in that perspective i think they could help me but i also thought they could in the same sense i believe they can it's just depending on what they're willing to do or what they're willing to give now, some people are only willing to do what you pay them for, which is it's understandable. But in the same sense, in this society, you don't want to only just pay people to do things for you. You want to know how to do things for yourself. That's why they say you teach a man to fish. He learned to fish for life or you show a man how to fish. I don't know. I didn't say that right, but that's not the principle, okay? You get what I'm trying to say. But knowing how to fish for yourself can save you a lifetime of investing in others to do it for you. Which is why I do believe that I still need to focus on my own way of marketing, but I still feel like I need to have investors behind me pushing and aspects that I'm not great in. I mean, at the end of the day, I'm only so good at so much, right? I only have so much skill in so many things. I'm not going to force myself to do things I'm not great at. But I will make myself learn the skill. Even if I'm not great at it. But I've been really trying to figure out a lot of stuff. I know it requires me to focus on one thing in order that I may get better. I can't focus on multiple different things and expect greatness because if you utilize all your energy into in all different aspects, then you won't get full quality out of your um, your work ethic. But if you focus on one thing and pour all your energy and effort into that one thing, then you can get greater results that way. But I am very multi-talented. And very multi-passionate. I'm one of those individuals who can't just consistently focus on one thing. So it's hard for me to remain disciplined and focus on one specific thing. Because there's so many things I'm passionate about. I'm an artist. I paint. I draw. I love to do art for people. I'm a writer. I write books. I want to focus on writing more books. Children's books. Mental health books. Things like that. But it requires money and then that means my money is going in multiple different directions because i am multi-passionate and multi-purpose filling i just have to figure this out you know what i'm saying so and it's just getting to the place where i'm not mad at myself for not having it figured out so i'm blessed i'm grateful i'm alive i have so much to live for so much purpose and so much that I can be thankful for right I've accomplished so much in the short period of time that I've lived but I want to accomplish so much more so just to say that though I did a lot I can do so much more and then I'm appreciative for my experiences and the things I've overcame but I'm glad you guys are part of my journey and I have watched so far but I appreciate all the love and support along the way whether you brought books watch my youtube channel buy my art listen to my audio podcast though i have not been posting any episodes on there i'm probably more consistent on youtube than i am on there 
which I will get back consistent on there. I probably will. Once I get away from this nine to five work hustle, working two jobs, working more than I should, then I can see myself really focusing on all the things I enjoy. But as of now, we're just focusing on this.